Hey everyone, Creative Venus here and this is a tutorial series to create this beautiful business infographic design and this is a part one of the video. So please subscribe to our channel, join the membership, hit like and share button and before moving further, let's watch this video. PDF Element Pro, the most productive PDF editing tool for working from home. It's an all-in-one PDF management tool where you can convert, create, combine, do batch processing and you can use hundreds of pre-built PDF templates. It has got these amazing features where you can convert this PDF in, in a single click like you can convert it into Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, you can edit the text, you can change the image, you can change the font size, color, you can also you know add comments, you can highlight the text. So there are so many features in this tool that you can use. So here you can see we have changed the text. Now we can even highlight the text as well. So it has got all the required features. Now we will save it in a PowerPoint format and look at this output. It has successfully converted it into a PowerPoint. So for more information about PDF Element Pro, just check out the links in the video description. So coming back to the tutorial, so we have created this tutorial in three parts. This is the first part where we will cover the base for this infographic. So let's insert this hollow circle, remove its outline and then insert the rectangle and draw it like this, remove its outline as well and reduce its width. 2.2 centimeters align center align middle and now you can give it some color so that you can easily select it now duplicate it and rotate it by 90 degrees and again align it to center and align to middle so now you have a hollow circle and two rectangular bars now select the hollow circle rectangular bar and subtract again repeat the same process and you will get a shape like this now what we will do is we will remove the three parts of this circle for that you need to go to edit shapes and start deleting these points so there are lots of points it will take you a couple of minutes to delete these points and in the end you will have one fourth of the circle left and that's what is required so there are many ways to do to achieve it either you can subtract it by using different shapes or you can follow this approach so this approach is the best because in the end we get the perfect shape so keep on deleting the points until you are left with one fourth of the circle and now you have this shape ready now we want to divide the shape into two parts as well for that you need to again insert the rectangle and rotate it by 45 degrees like this and align to middle align to center and place it like this and again we will subtract it select the shape and rectangular bar and merge shapes and subtract now again go to edit points and remove half of the shape by deleting the points. So now you're left with this shape and we will use this shape to create our infographic. And how we're gonna do that you need to insert this circle align to center line to middle and send it to back fill some color so that we can differentiate it 
and now you have this slide just duplicate it for the backup now you need to remember three steps you need to copy the shape and paste on the slide 3 group the shape with the existing circle and rotate and again paste so this is a four steps process and you have to repeat it until all the shapes are pasted and the circle is complete paste the shape group then again paste the shape while rotating so this is you have to do keep on rotating the shape until you get the complete circle and again paste and now you can see all the shapes are done and all the shapes are pasted here and a circle is ready now we don't need this background here just increase its transparency now just select this shape and go to shape format rotate and just play with these four options until it rotates like this and you have to manually adjust it like this and once it's done remove this part and duplicate this shape and flip it horizontally and manually adjust it now the base for the infographic is ready as you can see on the screen so this is the end of the part one and we will share the part two very soon in just a couple of days and we will learn how to complete this infographic so please subscribe to our channel join the membership and we will see you guys in our next video till then bye bye